Hello, welcome to Ekdel, where we train future smart structural engineers. Mm -hmm. uh, my name is Fasha Uchet. Today, I want to show you how to, you know, in a practical sense, you know, practically, this is what, that when it comes to steel, this is what we normally have, isn't it? This is what we normally have, but it's not like this. Is that okay? And we all know that it's not like this. So how do you now model it in total structure? So that's what I want to show you. How do you arrive at this? How do you model this? How can you go about this? Is what we are going to be showing you today. So because at site, during construction, it's not like this. You don't have like yeah, things like this at site. Is that okay? You don't have something like this at site. You don't have this one. Excuse me. Um, let me see. Okay, you don't have this. You don't have this at site. This is what you normally have at site, which I just finished showing you now. So this, this is what you normally have at site. Is that okay? So how do you model it? Is that okay? So all of this, I'm going to be showing you in this uh, video. How do you arrive at this to have this kind of uh, of shape of your roof crosses? How do you arrive at this? All of this, what we are going to be showing you in this video, because in a practical sense, this is not what is what obtainable. Is that okay? This is not what we have. Is that okay? So therefore, let's go there and see what we can achieve. Is that okay? Let's go there. All right, welcome back. So therefore, let's start. Now, going straight to the point, <coughs> all you need to do is to come here. Okay, first of all, let me take this one. Let me put all the trusses. Let me put all the trusses. Okay, um, let me start from here. Let me put here. Or oh, let me start from the front. From the front, let me start from here to this. And let's wait for it. Okay. All right, I'll pick this. All right, and then what's my height? my height um where are you okay is uh let me 800 since the frontage 800 okay and then how many number of uh now if actor gives you the angle so you can use the angle is that okay at times the actor during the roof uh, in their roof section normally they show angle so if they give you angle you can use this angle is that okay so that is that and then <clears throat> let me see okay 400 my eve and then 400 so you can see the 400 here you can see it here if i click on next page uh, on another thing now you see this place change can you see it now it has extended it has a 400 okay the number of uh, this okay it's a uh, 800 let me use uh, 800 or 900 900 you can see it has changed you can see can you see it now it has changed so that 900 so we are having about five four eight hundred and come in let me see where is it okay 852 is that okay 852 so this one also uh, this one let me make it five also five okay the same thing okay so that's basically that's from this point this point here to this point is 855 maybe at size maybe 900 or something so depending is that okay so that is that then i'll click on my okay let me see let me see what is again okay at joint you are fixed rather i click on it okay and also come here and click follow this video to the end if you really want to understand what we are doing so as you can see it i want to show you one part first and i'll explain the reason why so also let me click on this let me take this let me take this uh let me take this okay escape let me take this okay from there i also come to this place from this point to this point here also i have this but this time around this time around 400 400 you can still okay um it's not 800 it's a uh, 2005 2005 so can you see 2500 okay um how many how many it's not five we're talking of uh, let's say um 900 how many is it going to give us okay 12 so this one automatically 12 okay so you can see what n12 that's from this point to this point form of your line is that okay so that is that also let's proceed <clears throat> let's proceed let's proceed what is again okay okay all right it's okay then so let me also take this it's okay 2000 okay now this other side i can't click on it because the width is different is that okay we are having a different width is that okay we have a different width is that okay so i'm going to explain all of this so let's proceed let me proceed let me proceed okay let me escape okay let me proceed okay let's click on this one then this one the width here is different okay, okay let me come to this other side and fix this okay the same everything is okay the same the same is okay um let me see 
okay it's okay so the same is okay my nine okay see within then click on okay now i can now continue and be clicking on this since they have the same width now from here so i'll proceed up to this and also continue to this point to this point and also continue also continue to this uh, this point here and also i guess to this point here let me rotate and see let me rotate escape let me escape let me rotate and see okay we are correct okay we are good to go okay all right that is that um haven't explained this now remain how to show you how to now you know as we said this one this is not how it's been done at sight it's okay you don't have something like this at sight you can be, it can come like this but at this point it becomes flat here so the line will be in line with what with this uh with this uh, column or your beam whichever is okay so how do you do that i'm going to show you now but before then before then let me show you something now if you look at this place it's of different width is that okay this place to that place from here to this place different width you can see the width from here to this place and the width from here to this place you can see that they are not the same thing isn't it so that is that so and how to how do you go about that okay let me set an example okay for example let me just use these two these two this one and this one to show you something let me put my pole line okay let me say for line where's my pole line let me click on the pole line okay i click on the first one and this other one okay let it come up okay let it come up. it's coming up let's come up all right so as you can see it here it has come up is that okay so i'll click on okay let me click on okay first let's see let's see what we're going to be having let's see what you are going to be having okay if you look at this if you look at it it bends is that okay if you look at it very well it bends isn't it you can see it's not straight is that okay so but if i click on this one if i make this one and the other one you discover that it will be okay that's this one and also this one oh, sorry sorry let me escape sorry let me click on it again pull line click on this and then um, this one and also this one so let's wait for it to come up let's wait for it okay this one and this one okay why is it not coming up okay so you can see it here now so you can see it since i click on it so click on okay let's see what will happen let's see let's see okay because that this one is straight so if you now compare the two now can you see what we are having this is not okay is that okay the reason is because why we are having something like this is because the width here is right from the width here this one is, is longer than this one is that okay so now how do you rectify this one so all you need to do is to click on this okay let me come to this place let me zoom it let me take these trusses okay let me escape let me escape i'll just click on this on this one then property let me take the property of this and let me rectify that that's the one i want to show you so now click on this um where is it where is it where is this placement top code by trust this one i'm coming okay not this this one uh -huh. by spacing yes by spacing you can now come to default and now come to the word at shutter click on ok and once you have click on ok then click on ok let me see can you see it now can you see what we are having can you see it it's perfectly straight now is that okay so that is it that is that now on how to now make this as what we have shown I've, I've shown you let's now see how this one can be done let's now go to that and now click on this right click then come to property come to this property and then come to this place now i haven't done all of this all you need to do is to come to this place you can now see this place saying make bottom what called papain is that okay perpendicular to what to support so i'll click on check if i check it can you see it has changed you know now come to this place click on ok and let's wait for it is that okay thank you so can you see it now can you see it this is what is being achieved at site is that okay during construction during fabrication all of this things. so you can see it here also i'll come to this place also i'll click on this one i'll click on this one sorry i'll click on this right click and then also go to property and also do the same thing now okay, go down and then click on this and also click on what on my okay then once i've done that i'll go to the next one okay can you see it so i'll go to the next one click on this and also click on this property and finally so this is how you go about it and if you want it you can just do it at once you can just do it at once if they are the same width or during uh during editing which is this place you can just click on it and then just click on what on okay so that you just do it once and for all is that okay that is that so you can see this is how you go about it so you can see you cannot do the rest is that okay you cannot go 
and do what uh, complete the rest as your own practice is that okay so you can see it at this end too so you can see it so this is how to go about it and by the time you are drawing your section how to draw the section go and watch our complete course on steel you will see how to cut a section completely and how to detail it is that okay you see how to cut the section that will come out exactly like this you know this one when you look at it you know that this is real is that okay so that is the that is that so in case you have not clicked on like button, I want to say you should click on like button and give this video or give this video a thumbs up. And not only that, if this is your first time of watching our video from Ekidel, I want to say that you should click on subscribe button so that you can have access to all our videos that we have done at the same time that will, subsequent one that will be posting. Is that okay? So that is that. I like, see you next time in our next video on how to do a lot of things when it comes to use product structure to do a lot of things when it comes to structural design. So thank you very much that each day we get better day by day. Thank you very much. I like, see you next time. Bye.